In this video, I'm going to introduce you to something called CSS. It stands for Cascading Style Sheets. Specifically, I'm going to show you how to do something called inline CSS first. With inline CSS, you can change the style of any individual element on an HTML page. Let me show you how that works. I can set up a division of code, shortened to div. So this title of the, my fifth favorite Pixar movie is now in a div. And I can create a style attribute in order to format it. I can say things like color yellow, um, font size 32. And I can change the font type if I type font family. And I'm going to set it to be Arial. If I save it and refresh, you can see it changed the font type, the font size, and the color of the text. I'm just going to copy and paste that same styling around each of the titles of these movies. I'm going to save it and refresh. Sometimes when I save, I actually just use the shortcut key, Control S, or Command S on a Mac. I refresh, and now you can see each of the titles now has that style. Okay, now let's change the title of the page where it says My Favorite Pixar Movies. Let's make it a little bit bigger. So right here where it says h1, it turns out h1 can have attributes also. We don't have to create a div for it. We can just say style equals and say font size 48 so that it will be bigger than the other ones. And you can see it worked. OK, let's center everything. And one easy way to do that is to take the body element um, and look at the body tag here. I have an opening tag here at the top, and that encloses the entire content of this page all the way down to where it closes that body tag. So everything inside of here is going to be affected by the style I give this. So I can say style equals text align center. If I save and refresh, now you can see it's all been centered. Okay, and one last thing I want to do because the yellow is kind of hard to see on a white background, let's change the background color of the entire page to be a dark blue color. And there are some presets already in HTML that we can use. One of them is called Midnight Blue. So if I save that, refresh. Oh. It looks like now the title's kind of hard to see. Uh, so let's change the color of the title also to be white. And we save that. And click refresh. And we're done. And that's inline CSS.